I'm out. What if you caught me one? What if you caught me one? What if you did that? Mm. What if you caught me one? That would be something you could do. You know, if you wanted to, you could catch me one, and then I would have one. So wait, I, do I have a Pokemon to trade you? I don't, right? No, I don't believe so. You got like all of them. You've been doing great. Yeah. Let me see your party. I just want to see your party. I just want to see them. Eevee? Can I just see them just so I know what you got? I want to see what I got and I want to see what you got. I think that's cheating. It's really not cheating. I just want to know what you've got in relation to what I've got. That's my team. We're both using Alakazam, that's right. I'm trying to make a decision about Alakazam. I don't really want to use the same Pokemon you're using. So I might use... Well, let me catch this mime. Like, <laughs> Let me catch this mime and we'll talk. Oh my god, there is one! I touched his butt. I touched his butt. We'll see if you can catch him. I touched his butt. I didn't get a great. I didn't get an excellent. I do not deserve this Pokemon. And I didn't get him. I don't deserve your pointy shoes. That was really bad. That was worse. That was worse than the first throw. I didn't get him again. Surprising literally nobody. Okay, hold on. Hold on, he's over on the left there. I got. I touched him with the ball, but it's not gonna work. There's no chance. He's definitely going to... I got him! I got him! I caught Mr. Mime! Good job. I didn't expect to get that guy. I did not expect. And yet, I've done the impossible. Also, this is a female Mr. Mime, so this is Miss Mime. He takes up so much space when he's large. She's large. Glurp. Glurp in all caps? I hate that name. <laughs> what kind of awful name is Glurp? Okay, sure. All right. Glurp loves the Seattle mud crabs. Go mud crabs. Let's go. Let's three? go. Let's go. I did it. I did it. What do you? What can you do? What? What? Nothing. What? What is your? What is your deal? <laughs> what is your deal, Glurp? Um, I don't know that I want you. He said to the Pokemon to its face. <laughs> I'm the strongest amongst my friends. No one says that. No one said. No one walks into a target and shouts that. That's not a thing that you do. All right, Pikachu, do a little zap on the Slowpoke, and maybe a little zap for the Sailor, too. <laughs> We're gonna be out here committing murder. <laughs> Emil says, normal people say they're the third strongest amongst their friends. There's there's some, some amount of, of humbleness. <laughs> like, well, I'm not the strongest. I am the third strongest. I also live underground. Oh no, Beatrice, you're paralyzed. How dreadful. I've been paralyzed. And confused. Good. All right, so I'm gonna walk in this door just to see what's in here. I have a suspicion we can't go any further. <laughs> oh, oh, well, hold on now. If you're aiming to reach Lavender Town, go through the rock tunnel. You can get to the rock tunnel from Cerulean City. Okay. Don't you think it's hard to think up good names for Pokemon? Not really, not, <laughs> not when you have an entire audience of a thousand people doing it for you. <laughs> But then again, why not just try out new nicknames every day until you get it right? Wouldn't that be traumatizing for your Pokemon? That seems that'd be really, really awful. If I just kept naming them different things, they'd be like, I don't have any sense of identity. Please stop doing this. Hi, remember me? I'm one of Professor Oak's assistants. The professor told me that if your Pokedex has good data on 30 species of Pokemon, I'm to give you the judge function. Oh my god. What does that mean? So Steven, let me ask you, have you gathered data on at least 30 species of Pokemon? No. I have, yeah. Great, you have caught 38 species of Pokemon. Congratulations, now let me update your Pokemon box. What is Judge? You I don't wanna- You can find out while I deal with this. View a Pokemon summary via your Pokemon box and you'll be able to see their potential. Their potential? Oh, let's do it to the mime. All right, Glurp. How do I judge you? Check summary. Check summary. Judge. Amazing stats. Good job. Okay. Cool. That's a good Glurp right there. I want to head to Lavender Town, but there's this huge Pokemon in the way. Sound asleep. 
so I've decided to die <laughs> upstairs in this rest area. I, I actually thought they were supposed to get on the SSN like immediately. And that's not what's hap- oh wait, yeah it is. What's up, bud? A Pokemon is sprawled out in a deep and comfortable slumber. Sometimes Pokemon come to sleep on this path and don't wake up for a long time. When that happens, it's recommended that you take the other route around them. So much for that. Uh, on the bright side, Mal, you don't have to go here. I want judge function. Well, if you, you, what, what was that? I want the judge function. All right, what else is around here? Anything? There's eradicate. There's something special. That's just a retaliate. It's not special enough. Yeah, it is dead. Move is broken. Move is extremely broken. You walk into battle and you're like, I, I have a handgun. The other Pokemon's like, whoa, whoa. Uh, this dude has a handgun. And, and you're, the trainer's like, I don't know. Nine more? Give me nine more so I have 25. 25 is a number that makes me feel, oh, I should have bought 10. Cause you get a free freaking. But my desire to land right on 25 was too great. It's foiled by my hubris. How many did thing. he say you caught? Uh, you needed 30? I know, but how many did you have? 38. Oh, are you gonna judge me? It's the name of the move. I hate that. 43? How'd you, uh, how'd you do that? You have five more Pokemon than me? I thought maybe one or two difference. I can't believe you have five more. Where did you get them? Who did you kill? Look at these amazing stats. That's insane. It's literally a perfect DV. I know. Franklin will help me win this cave. Well, I'll be, did you know? This huge, long tunnel? It was dug entirely by Diglett. Thanks for the, thanks for the heads up. I gotta go in here and get some, I need to catch a Diglett. You wanna fight me? You definitely do. This path is closed because Diglett dug too many holes. While we're filling the holes, why don't you challenge the Vermilion City Gym? Oh. So there's nothing in there? No, in fact, there's not even Diglets. So this is one of those things that we'll do after the gym. Okay. So I, I was right. I thought, I was like, I feel like you get shoehorned into SSN, and you do. Um, but they give you just enough room to go, like, look. And once you've gone to, like, look at some stuff, then you realize you're not allowed to do it.